It's Tuesday, March 4th, 2014. I'm Sam Sheffer, and Bill Gates might be the richest person in the world, but last night I ate 14 fish tacos. So who's the real winner here? This is 90 Seconds on the Verge. Wallet and banking service Flexcoin is shutting its doors after hackers stole 896 Bitcoin from the company, rendering them unable to continue functioning. While not as central to the Bitcoin community as Mt. Gox was, the Flexcoin shutdown is another blow to an ecosystem that's facing growing doubts from would-be regulators and government. With the increase in these kind of heists, we can expect Ocean's 14 to be a much different film. Gerard Butler may have battled North Korea in last year's Olympus Has Fallen, but this time he has a new enemy the FCC. The FCC has issued a $1.9 million fine against Viacom, NBC Universal, and ESPN for their promotions of last year's action film with TV spots featuring the two-tone emergency alert system. The cable companies have all acknowledged that they approved the video that included the tone. I guess they should have just gone for their original choice of music in the trailer. And finally, adults need protein, but more importantly, they need food found in elementary school cafeterias. Oscar Mayer has launched a new take on its Lunchables brand called P3, short for Portable Protein Pack. The snack comes in four different flavors, each packaged with around 13 grams of cheese, nuts, and meat. P3 is available now, and no, there's no pizza option. And that's it for today's top stories. Coming up tomorrow, Betty Crocker revives an old favorite and starts selling adult Dunkaroos.